Hello everyone, my name is Gnana Raju uh, from Herbalife Nutrition. I'm a 20K Senior Executive President Team member working for the last 17 years. I'm very proud and happy to present you this video on uh, uh, actually the visceral fat, what exactly this visceral fat and how it all works out. Okay, so let me explain you about this visceral fat and the connection with the obesity. So visceral fat, uh, before sharing that visceral fat video, let me explain myself. My name is Gnana Raju. I worked as a district registrar in a group, in under group one service of Andhra Pradesh government as a gadget officer. After working there for 10 years, I quit my job. So there, I, my job was very hectic and, uh, you know, very prestigious position. But uh, because of, fortunately, because of my wife, I came into this uh, company. And uh, I have science background. I have a lot of passion to passion to help people. So that's the reason why I quit my job and came into this. My wife, you can see the wonderful transformation in my me also. You can see the wonderful transformation. I'm 50 years now, 50 years age, and my wife is 43 years now. We both looking healthier and younger. That's the reason why we quit my job. And uh, now with this uh, left side picture to right side picture, there is a 20 years of gap. But we are looking better and healthier. My children grow, grown so taller with the right kind of nutrition. We both looking gorgeous. You can see we are maintaining for last uh, 17 years with this wonderful nutrition and healthy active lifestyle. So let me talk about this uh, slide. It's called visceral fat. This presentation is all about visceral fat. What exactly is visceral fat? Visceral fat is the fat inside the intestine. If you see this the left side man is, uh, the, what is shown in the white color is fat. Particularly, there are subcutaneous fat under the skin fat and the fat inside the stomach region called visceral fat. Now, as you can see, this what is shown in the red color is muscle mass and, you know, that is healthy. Left side is healthy, but right side is not healthy is a problem. So, we can see this picture. So, what is shown there, it, uh, you know, is 40% of body fat levels. And if you want, you will really wonder, some people are underweight, but still there will be visceral fat. So don't, you know, imagine that all uh, lean people are clean. It's not true. Some lean people, they do, though they are lean, they're underweight, but they have a lot of visceral fat inside. So um, uh, this is in a way visceral fat is the fat inside the stomach region. So it has to be removed. It has to be, you know, immediately either you to, to go for some kind of uh, treatment like uh, nutrition, exercise and uh, lifestyle corrections. So how much is the natural visceral fat limit? It should not cross more than nine so two to five is ideal beyond five to nine is okay but uh, above 10 to 14 is high and above 15 is very high so i seen i've seen a lot of clients coming with uh, visceral fat 20 25 30 which is very deadly dangerous so waste is the mother of all diseases so uh, you, as you can see this slide it causes a lot of 80 percent of type 2 diabetes because of um, fat 70 percent because of heart heart problem because of fat and 40 percent because of breast and uh, colon cancer because of fat, 30% gallbladder gall you know, surgeries can be avoided with, you know, for, by fat reduction, like this. You can see a lot of kidney failure and a lot of cancers, including breast cancer, prostate cancer, all these cancers also because of obesity or fat. So visceral fat actually it affects so many complications. So that's why it's called it metabolic syndrome. So it causes, you know, including gallbladder stone, fatty liver, non-alcoholic fatty liver, a pancreatitis, a gynecologic problem, periods problem, you know, PCOD, a lot of things, you know, it has a lot of connection. So fat, see if it is there accumulated in the abdominal region is called apple shape or android shape. If it is accumulated in the hip region is called pear shape or gynoid, gynoid obesity. Apple shape or android shape is more dangerous you know, because the visceral fat is then the tummy region, uh, then the pear shape or gynoid obesity. So why? Because the, the fat, you know, the inside the stomach region has this visceral fat. So that's the reason why visceral fat causes, you know, uh, heart disease, cancer, stroke. Stroke is like a paralysis stroke, arthritis, type 2 diabetes, and sexual arousal dysfunction. So uh, that's the reason why I try to overcome this, you know, this uh, visceral fat. You can see the fat in accumulate in the heart region and, you know, sometimes it is there in the liver, it, sometimes it's there in the kidney. And uh, so you can trust on the muscle mass, not on the fat. Fat is slippery. So don't rely on that. Unfortunately, a lot of people accumulate that fat instead of muscle mass. So these uh, fat cells, you know, causes a lot of hormonal problems particularly, you know, adiponectin, I'm going to throw some light on the hormones. So if you see this, you know, jelly, uh, the left side is full of, you know, gel rather than the fruit, whereas right side is full of fruit, or less of jelly. So left, right side is the okay, but left side is too much of fat is there. So jelly is something reflecting the fat. If you see this left side is clean, visceral, the intestine is clean, 
but what is shown the right color is you know right side all yellow color is fat visceral fat so that is not good so that's the reason they say bigger the waistline shorter the lifeline jitna bada pet jitna so utna bada set that's what we say but it is actually wrong so we have to say jitna how much is the fat how much is the pet ka size so itna patient hai so this is what you have to tell them so with the age unfortunately the fat accumulates by default without you doing anything so that's the reason why when you age actually you have to take double double care you to lose the tummy so that's the reason why that you require to go for a lean pet lean stomach so lean belly instead of going for a pot belly don't go for pot belly very dangerous pot belly or android obesity is more dangerous apple shape is more dangerous so the liver becomes like fatty liver you see this the liver is rich in red color but it becomes like a whitish you know or uh, gray you know reddish color or brownish color why but the liver itself causes you know removes that fat actually the one which burns the fat is liver it itself becomes like a you know fatty liver so like a police becoming you know thief then who will rescue that village or town you tell me like that so fatty liver disease is more dangerous so it becomes like a vicious cycle for many other people the fatty liver if it comes in the first two levels you can save otherwise it goes to cirrhosis equivalent to cancer so it's more deadly so you require even if you spend 30 to 40 lakhs in hospitals you difficult to come out of it so liver transplantation is very expensive so you have to go with the heart transplantation so that's the reason i'm telling you liver once it got damaged it causes havoc leptin adiponectin and ghrelin and a lot of insulin lot of bad hormones will be you know disturbed will be disturbed and naturally causes more further fat accumulation like uh, that's why i said it's like a vicious cycle the you the more fat is accumulating more fat you know causes more problem so i start accumulating more even more fat so healthy liver this is fatty liver if you see down it's called gall bladder stone so gall bladder stone is one of the uh, you know symptoms is one of the offshoot of you know result of because of fatty liver and obesity so why all this complication pancreatitis even uh, pancreas also becomes you know uh, problematic fat necrosis will happen so blood circulation to heart and brain so it also interferes so brain circulation is nothing but you know you, you know this you know uh, brain stroke it causes paralysis heart circulation causes you know heart attack so this fat accumulation actually interferes in the blood circulation causes atherosclerosis uh, stiffening of the arteries plaque build up and inflammation so this is the reason why heart attack you know most of the people first attack is very deadly uh, and uh, plaque and atherosclerosis uh, balloon angioplasty you know coronary angio all these are you know unnecessary things you can prevent that's why prevention is always better than cure heart also gets enlarged so that's the reason why prevention is always better than cure media also enlightening you know how to lose that fat so losing fat how so we first have to understand how much of the body fat you got in your body so we have a lot of parameters waist circumference body mass index and body fat and bio impedance so these are bioelectrical impedance analyzer we have our own test by which we'll scan and we we'll let you know how much muscle mass how much physical weight how much is the body fat visceral fat bone mass and all that so we'll help you with the first once we test and we'll give you the reading then you can able to understand how much of the visceral fat content and though bmi is not the accurate indicator but a lot of indicators are there waist to hip ratio is also one of the very good ratio to impacting uh, visceral fat so so these are the ratios and uh, men should not cross the waistline more than 94 cm women should not cross more than 80 cm of waistline so our diet intake should be very balanced you know omega 3 is supposed to be increasing omega 6 is supposed to be fats should be decreasing so omega 3 foods are lot of have, having lot of healthy benefits particular nervous system blood pleasure and you know even assisting storing the burning the fat so that's reason we have this herbal life line omega 3 fats and including epa and dha iconopentanoic acid and docosa hexanoic acid in terms of supplement in you know, a capsule form with the vitamin e they are really very good and very helpful for your uh, you know body so and uh, when you go you know when your diet try to cut down on saturated fats cut down on vegetable oils then for cooking purpose eat more of nut oils rather than vegetable oils and uh, per person your oil consumption should not cross half kilo oil or half liter oil per person per month in your family if uh, there are four people they require to, to go depend on not more than 2 liters or 2 kg so also eat uh, low gi low glycemic index and the foods which are low in gl glycemic load 
so our shakes and uh, supplements are low in glycemic index glycemic load and multivitamin mineral herbal tablets also will be a lot of help for you uh, because they improve the metabolism including the cell activator we have the powerful antioxidants like uh, resveratrol alpha lipoic acid polyphenols of pomegranates all from natural sources they also help you for nutrition absorption vitality and energy unhealthy gut you know unhealthy digestive system is causes you know gut is actually like called a second brain so it causes a lot of havoc so that's the reason why we have this uh, digestion health for the healthy digestion healthy gut allo plus you can allo vera in terms of capsule and herbal allo concentrate also for you know for a gut friendly thing so also we also have probiotic supplements so probiotics are now has come out with a lot of research you know they are proven to be very helpful for our gut gut and you know um, this you know we have this microbiome in the stomach so we also have this you know beta heart for good for the, removing the bad cholesterol and uh, for uh, you know making uh, stomach you know the particular gastric friendly fiber is very important you know this her uh, fiber also helps to lower cholesterol so fiber rich foods you are supposed to eat so don't eat maida based or refined flour based and eat all fruits and vegetable based so we also have fiber uh, rich you know uh, supplements also we have cellulose meant for removing the cellulite the thick fat and uh, stubborn fat and also removes the water retention of body cellulose and we also recommend exercise not just only walking we just have to be balancing both aerobic and anaerobic exercises and uh, we our nutrition is full of rich in uh, nutrition nutrition dense and low in calories and uh, this is uh, like a, for a smart kind of work this is uh, like a smart food and our food is all balanced we always promote balanced diet and you know exercises and hydration and water and rest and sleep healthy active lifestyle and empty calories don't depend on empty calories like biscuits and sweets and uh, ice creams go for natural food and uh, don't depend on the uh, desserts and sweets there are hundreds of empty calories hundreds of sugars and saturated fat we don't require so much you know we don't want so much so try to cut down as much you can don't want frozen fat don't want this you know uh, saturated fat and cut down as much you can on the alcohol content alcohol also has calories you know it and uh, don't eat uh, you know um, uh, don't eat uh, uh, before 3 hours before going to bed so at least you know if you are going to bed at uh, say 10 o'clock you finish off your eating by 7 o'clock at least see that you have 3 hours of gap and stop eating fatty food and fried food and sweets and we also have this best to breakfast award winning you know nutrition for breakfast and the dinner and lunches so you can depend on our supplements also and we also have award winning you know scientist nobel prize winning scientist recommended and designed products called nitrox for heart and you know blood circulation and other things with supported by nitric oxide supplements and uh, which one is the best carbs you know it you now we don't rec- don't depend on the simple sugars refined sugar depend on the complex carbohydrates you know best uh, nature god gifted fruits and vegetables and our products are you know backed by designed by 50 plus phd's and 300 staff scientists herbalife is the number one brand in the weight management number one brand in meal replacement and protein supplements combined and we are all award winning and we do hundreds of tests not one not few tens hundreds of tests before going to the mouth so this is called seed to feed from from the you know from the uh, plantation to the mouth so we ensure that hand valve products are very highly quality and uh, tested for your consumption so take care of your body is the only place you have to live our body treat your body like a temple that's what jimran says i myself you know understand this and uh, we've been practicing for last 17 years my wife and my children i'm 50 years as i said and um, you can see me there in you know, we have with uh, working with our clients blue t-shirt and uh, this is a green t-shirt you can see me there we're helping our clients doing exercises and uh, you know we pre, you know we do a lot of uh, recognition to our clients and we educate and we celebrate their success we create healthy community in our clubs nutrition centers and wellness centers and uh, we create a, you know we a lot of education we do we are specialized in that right so i personally myself i do you know half marathon half i run half marathon i i do cycling for 40 km i'm a triathlete okay my children also triathletes and my wife also into healthy active lifestyle about to myself already given you know 17 years into this field at lifestyle certified nutrition fitness consultant certified sports nutrition consultant certified exercise and specialist certified by american society of nutrition marathon runner cyclist cpr ad certified zumba zumba and strong by zumba instructor and these are my phone numbers and email ids insta and facebook and website youtube channels are there so you can contact us anytime if you like it but uh, if some 
someone recommends please approach that person not me if someone recommends this video please approach him in case he, he, no one recommends you, you yourself came to this video please uh, come into uh, you know come into our channel and contact us and uh, if you like this video please subscribe and uh, recommend this video to many people by forwarding this video and uh, we appreciate your time thank you so much for uh, you know your time and wish you all the best god bless you thank you so much bye